without new evidence or additional evidence for dead in the water. In 2004, in a tiny Ozark town, a young woman named Rebecca Gold was brutally murdered. She never got to be who she was going to be because they took that from her. I was saying her, you know, the other day when she came down, you know, that she's supposed to be heading to Melbourne. That's the last that I'd heard anything from her. Nearly 15 years later, her killer is still on the loose. Potential suspects work everywhere, so we could have already talked to the killer. Right. It's just really surreal that it they're is. out and walking around. You know, That's like, why I don't mention so much because I'm being recorded because I'm not scared. People just seem to die around her. I haven't slept in about three days. So obsessed at this point, I'm thinking I'm just going to stay for a while. I left Arkansas, became an investigator, and now I'm coming back with my team to finally get justice for Rebecca. There's two guys out there. You ready? Yep. Take a deep breath, dude. It's a small town, and I know someone has a secret that will break this case wide open. Why are they all keeping so quiet? Not everybody wants to talk or wants this case solved. We literally are back to the where we were the day that they found her body. I'm not stopping until someone starts talking. In my heart, in my opinion, I always thought it had, he knew something more than what he was saying or he had done it. And we finally find out who killed Rebecca Gould. I'm Katherine Townsend, and this is Hell and Gone. Somebody asked me, they said, you're not going to take a picture of that, are you? And I said, no. I said, I'm going to spend the rest of my life trying to forget about this. Coming this October from School of Humans and How Stuff Works. <laughs>